Hello, Carl here with Sustainability Theory News. We're over at BuildItSolar.com. It's a site for do-it-yourselfers who want to build their own solar projects. Right now, I'm here to talk about a new trickle-down solar heating system based on the Thompson trickle-down system. And I believe, yeah, the, here's the page here. They have a link to all the Thompson-based patents for solar heating. But this one, they cost them about 1800 bucks, and in this article is a link to the PDF right here that details pretty well how this thing was built. Basically, it has a little 24 volt pump powered by the solar panel, so when the sun's out, the pump's running. When it's not, the water goes right back down into the storage tank to protect it from freezing. Now, <clears throat> the water will come up the top here, drip down here, get heated, and then goes through a heat exchanger that he built using these forms. So this isn't the storage tank, obviously. He just used this figure eight pattern, these two cardboard and wood cylinders, to wrap the copper piping around it into what he calls a figure eight or racetrack pattern, believing it will have greater surface area than just having one rounded cylinder of a heat exchanger coil. He's using refrigerant copper, uh, one half inch outer diameter, flexible refrigerant copper used in uh, for air conditioning repair, that sort of thing. And then he puts it in a storage tank, and they don't have a picture of the storage tank in this PDF. I'll link to this page, which has a link to the PDF. But um, they talk about how it had a cotton-based lining with a sort of silicon-based waterproofing. And they're going to test and see how well that does under long-term use. Which is another good thing about this build at solar.com. Lots of different projects, and some of the contributors contribute a whole lot of data. For example, this guy here, he had all sorts of uh, graphs and did some testing in July, and uh, all sorts of great information, if you want, and including the cost and the parts that he used, about 1800 bucks for the whole thing. If you have some ideas and you want to hash them out, see if other people have done it, or if you've had a successful solar project and you want to share it with the world, perhaps go to builditsolar.com and post it there. I will link to this page in the description if you'd like to read more about it. And if you'd like to see more news headlines like this, subscribe to my channel. Have a great day.